So starting off right away, we are going in with this No Blem Pore Minimizer, you could say, from Touch and Soul. And I am really just rubbing this everywhere. Um, I have really bad pores on my T-zone, but that's about it. But I still like to use it anywhere, pretty much. Also, my tripod broke off into my other camera. So that's why you can see the shadow of my camera and it's just sitting on boxes. Anyway, for foundation, I'm using my Maybelline Superstay Foundation in shade 118 with a Real Techniques sponge. I absolutely love this foundation. It is super full coverage and very buildable, so you can go a little light on the coverage. I think it'll always be a medium coverage, but you are able to go full coverage. So that is what I'm doing. <laughs> I also really take my time blending in my foundation. Of course, this just helps make it look like you have such a very like even skin tone. I don't know how to word that, but I'm just showing you guys pretty much how long it takes me. Obviously, it's cut up a little bit, but just take your time. Next, I'm going in with my Too Faced Born This Way Concealer in Light, I believe. I have had this forever, you guys, and I still have a lot left. Definitely recommend this product. It doesn't dry me out as much as the Tarte Shape Tape, but I really do like the Tarte Shape Tape, like nothing against it at all. But for this, I am just putting it pretty much everywhere I normally would, under my eyes, on my chin, my nose, and yeah. I'm also, again, taking that same sponge and just blending it in. Next up to set everywhere, I just highlighted, I am taking my Airspun Loose Face Powder. I haven't used this in forever and they had it at Target and I was like, you know what, I'm going to try it again. Um, and I am actually not really baking. I usually put all my loose powder on with a sponge and really press it in there. But since I want a very dewy, glowy look, I am just lightly pressing that powder in. And I also am leaving it, but I mean, I'm just baking barely. Next, I'm going in with this Cover FX palette and I'm taking the contour color and one of the highlighting shades and actually mixing that together to kind of create my own personalized bronzer. So with this, when you mix a highlighter with like a bronzer or contour color, I think it just makes it look so much more even instead of when people, I mean, I definitely still do this, but for this look, I just think it makes it look so much more even and blended out especially when that highlighter is just kind of all over and it's not a solid line on your cheek or anything I did decide to go a little bit extra since I'm wearing an off the shoulder top and take that highlighting shade and put it on my shoulder and collarbones. Obviously you don't have to do this, um, but if you totally want to, totally do it. Anyway, I'm also taking that on my nose and my cupid's bow. And again, I am taking a Real Techniques blush brush. I just like how big it is and how much like coverage you get with it. Now to set my face, I am taking the Makeup Revolution Pro Fix Fixing Spray absolutely love this stuff and just drenching my face in it and I actually am just letting it kind of air dry to get that super dewy effect now I'm going in with a gel a brow gel to be exact this is from essence and just using that to kind of tame my brows Moving on to lashes, I am just going to curl my lashes. This is just a basic lash curler, I believe from Target, and it's actually a piece of crap. Um, I, when I went to college, it actually ripped out my eyelashes, but anyway. Now I'm taking the IT Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. I got this in my BoxyCharm, you guys, and this is the best mascara I've ever had, honestly. It makes my lashes look so full and long when I literally, I used to have beautiful lashes but now I don't because I wear so many like false lashes. Um, next I am just taking this NYX lip cream in nude I believe and just putting that all over my lips. 
You can always add a pair of false lashes if you'd like, but this is the finished look. Super simple, very easy, and yet still glowy. So you can definitely wear this out whenever you want, maybe just for a date night or just a simple day out glam. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys all in my next video.